Come on, wake it up, wake it up, boy. You already know it's Diesel Talk. Man, come on. What everybody doing on this Sunday, man? You know, on this beautiful Sunday, you know? You know what I'm saying? You got to be blessed, man, to get up. You know, on this beautiful Sunday, you know, if y'all listening, who's listening? You know, who's paying attention? Yeah, because it's always lessons that needs to be learned. And listen, those lessons need to be learned because right now, listen, the physical battle is over. That's why niggas is losing, putting they self and responding physically. You're not going to do nothing but go to jail. You're getting caught up. You're bringing a whole bunch of unnecessary attention to yourself that you can't get out of. So it's like a free booking, you feel me? It's 2024. I don't know why niggas is trying to use the old system that's obsolete. Thinking with the primitive state of mind, we are in a damn time where it's just spiritual warfare, you feel what I'm saying? And this is why niggas, this is why when everybody tries to use the rule system of, of, of taking people out physically, it's not doing nothing this damn time. You just, to be honest, when you do that, you just a, you just a dead nigga gone. The, 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 the nigga who killed him, he's a story. He's booked forever. And then nobody even cares. And then the problem still exists. It's still there. You got to, you got to, you got to strategize mentally around these people in this damn time. You got to know that. That means everybody you interact with, everybody you deal with, you feel what I'm saying? If they not, and if they not mentally seeing the war like you, you got to really stay away from them. Because some people will get touched spiritually too. It ain't even the physical war. Niggas is already scared physically, but they but they more scared physically, spiritually. Trust me. Trust me, that mental war, that's when you breaking down the man. The man that you interacting with, the man that you dealing with. See, everybody wants to present themselves in the highest fashion possible. First thing they try to, first thing to deliver that outlet, the first thing they try to do, do it on is social media. And then they try to uphold that image in real life. But it's going to wear off. And you see it wearing off because you see the spiritual side of things. See, when you all the way going into the physical side of things, motherfuckers can show you some buster ass traits personally in real life. And you and you uh uh you turn uh you just turn turn up turn the other cheek. You feel me? You turn the other cheek. You turn the other cheek because for whatever reason, for you, how how you feel like you could benefit from a person, from how you feel like you could change a person, how 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 you feel like you could manipulate a per all that and above. But you already see this trait. That, that, that this motherfucker has took form of Mr. Potato Head. Every person he meet, he's putting himself together. And this is what motherfuckers is doing. And that's all physical. Nope. That's obsolete. Gone. Who's doing it? Everybody. But we all live in that reputation, though. We all, we all, we all. I had to stop myself from that. I had to stop myself. Because that shit, hell no, nah, it'll get you brainwashed. You'll get bamboozled into the wrong system. Straight up. It's Diesel Talk, boy. Y'all wake it up. Y'all like and subscribe to the channel. We going up. You feel what I'm saying? And Because niggas is really scared to say they... Niggas are really scared to really say how they really feel. Even... It, it sounds so simple, but it's not. Trust me. It's not. You can sit there all day. You can wish it on the star. No. And I'm the prime example, and I'm part of the change. And that's why niggas will hate me. Because I'm going to really say, I do things, my shit may not be nothing up there on the internet yet. But guess what? It's authentic. You know who you're dealing with. Because I'm going to give you that and some when you, when, you, when you meet me personally. I'm going to be full of life, energetic, all that. I feel like myself in real life is 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 is, is double who I am uh, 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 on camera. But a lot of motherfuckers want to tuck. More motherfuckers want to tuck back. Act like they got. Act like they got all the tools for the for the for the for the battle that they fighting physically. You feel me? But want to duck back. And and, and 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 a lot of times we all could work with each other and, and, and network with each other because that's what we all really doing. 
That's what we all really doing at the end of the day. Every, if you not thinking money first and foremost with this shit, right. Then you thinking, you thinking wrong. Nigga, this is the metaverse. We entering it right now. Niggas got one foot in the physical world of it. And then a nigga definitely nigga got another foot in the metaverse. Because this is where he's doing all his worn at. But like I said, what's wrong with that? I'm happy with it. I like it. I like it. I want to take niggas out on the internet. If I'm beefing with a nigga, right. Because it really can't be that serious. Only way it's that serious if you taking it that serious. Because I feel like I've never said nothing to where, to where it's just ultimately just to where, oh, nigga, I don't want to kill that nigga. Niggas got the permanent meme mug on me. So you don't want niggas to have a permanent meme mug on you. You feel me? That means that some, niggas, some niggas, they get the permanent meme mug over little shit. You rub them the wrong way, nigga. They got the permanent meme mug on. I don't know why you see the homie's face like that. This nigga used to be up in there like this. This nigga's face. This nigga's face. Nigga had all type of wrinkles, nigga, and shit, nigga. Nigga was turning into a straight demon, nigga. <laughs> That nigga was bombing. Wake it up. Way we going up. It's diesel talk. Y'all already know. Y'all let me know how y'all feel in the comments, though. And I really want you guys to move accordingly, man. In a spiritual way. And that's using by yo, 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 inner spirit. Don't let that. Don't let that. Don't let that physical. Don't let that physical. Don't let that physical spirit overcome your inner spirit. Nigga, your inner spirit is going to tell you. That's your third eye. That's going to tell you, no, you shouldn't be doing this. Nigga, nah. Don't be going up in there. Don't be fucking with these dudes. It's going to tell you that. And it's going to tell you that immediately. You are going to be the one to neglect that and ignore that. And proceed and move forward in another direction that you know you just got a warning on. I hope y'all got that type of uh, insight. But I know it's like anything. It's like a dumb dog, nigga. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Everybody don't got it. So if your brain can't process that, you just got to go ahead and sit on back, nigga. Grab your, popcorn, bar, grab your popcorn and watch this shit from afar. You can't be trying to, no, nah, get up in this thing and navigate. <coughs> no, it's not going to work. But I just wanted to give you all that right now, man. Stop always trying to do this shit, man, physical, man. You're going to get beat on every day. Mm-hmm. I gotta make sure I keep my motherfucker. I bite my nails and shit. I gotta make sure I keep my niggas' knuckles all fucked up. If you've been squabbling for a long, that's what I'm saying. You feel me? Hands be hurting, you know? <coughs> I see why the boxers nigga wanna get paid so much. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. <clears throat> I see why the boxers niggas wanna get paid so much. Getting socked in the face and they got gloves on to protect their hands, you know what I'm saying? Because you know when you squabbling up in the streets and doing all that, your hands getting fucked up that shit hurt you know what i'm saying i hate when my hands flare back up you can't do nothing in the fight you know what i'm saying you scared to punch again because it feel like your hand gonna shatter you know but y'all let me know how y'all feel in the comments man y'all make sure you stay woke man with your game man remember man this is a spiritual battle you know what i'm saying so walk in that light you know what i'm saying use you use use it use it just try use it during the day Use your what what's your intuition. Do you let your intuition guide you, nigga, on, 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 on all the ways. And don't care about what the physical people think. Because they gonna think that. They supposed to think that. They want you in their crowd. No. Tell the niggas go catch up in their own crowd. I'm gone, boy.